What do you believe is the role of the family and what is the role of the school district in a child's education? Clearly, it is incredibly important for a family to be engaged in their child's education. Uh, without support at home, it is, it is tough. Yet, at the same time, we know that there's a varying level of engagement among families. And this is an unfortunate reality that we live with, that we live with today, and I don't think it's a surprise to anyone in this, to anyone in this room. Um, I do think the school district needs to be equipped to help students who come from various backgrounds. Some families that are more engaged, some families that are not as well engaged. And so the school district needs to be, needs to be prepared for various circumstances. And uh, it's important for the school district to provide everyone with an equal opportunity for a great education. Uh, I think we can all wish that yes, the family must be engaged and they need to be engaged. I think the reality is we can encourage that, we should encourage that, but that's not something that's going to happen 100% of the time. So the more we can have a school district that's equipped to deal with those varying circumstances and to do their best to give everyone an equal chance at a great education, we work, we work from that as a foundation and we work out from there. Can I just hear the question one more time? Sure thing. What do you believe is the role of the family and what is the role of the school district in a child's education? I believe parents are the first educators. Um, I think that values need to be taught at home and I believe that education should be about teaching facts and parents should never be afraid that when they drop their kids off at school that their family values will be undermined in any way. Um, I also believe that schools have to be very careful not to become parents when parents are failing to do their job. It does happen. Um, some parents are more engaged with their children. I think that the more the schools and I'm not sure if your question, you know, has that, you know, that ambiance in it or not, but the more schools step into the role of parenting, the more parents relinquish it to the schools. So I think that, that there is a danger in that. I think that we have to remember that schools are here, we pay our taxes so that kids learn to read, to write, to become um, hardworking citizens, but schools are not parents. Parents are the first teachers. And, Parents are where our values should be taught. We would like, uh, in a perfect world, to have the family chiefly responsible for the basic um, upbringing of our children. Uh, unfortunately, that isn't always the case. And I think it would be beneficial if, if we would recognize that. And and sometimes we push it aside and say, oh, well, that's just the way it is. Um, we have to deal with that. Unfortunately, uh, that means that the school has to deal with that. And um, we spend a great deal of money uh, doing that. And there's always a cry for more and more and more. And I'm not quite sure where we draw the line. Uh, the emphasis on accountability and getting those good scores on the state report card for the schools and, and our national assessments and so on means more and more intense interest in, in getting into the lives of the children down to what should be taking place in the family. That's a trend that there's just more and more micromanaging, I guess you would say, into the children's families. Nevertheless, at our West Bend School District, we have many programs that are aimed at helping in, this, uh, in these types of situations. We have the Head Start program, which includes a, uh, a component of getting parental involvement, which is really important. We have 4K 
which helps get, uh, especially the children who have not had um, a real good start in the family, get them a little bit more up to speed uh, for, for getting into school. We have um, special programs for dealing with children who do not speak English as a first language. We have programs to help children with disabilities. Um, so there's quite a, an extensive amount of work that is taking place, and it's always a question how much more.